Hi guys, I'm Bea from Ermundo Eats and today I'm going to show you how to make pineapple upside down cake using better and healthier ingredients. This cake is tender, soft, it's refined, sugar free and I hope you'll like it. We're going to start with the caramel. Here I have a quarter cup of butter and I'm using 9 inch cake pan that I have greased earlier. And here I have one third cup of brown sugar, just sprinkled evenly. And then we're just going to set this aside for a while. So I'm using fresh pineapple wings. You can also use canned pineapple, no problem at all. And now what we want to do is pat them really dry. So we don't want any extra moisture here because that's going to prevent our cake from getting soggy. You just cannot have upside down pineapple cake without some cherries, right? Now, set this aside while we make our cake batter. Our dry ingredients. 1 cup of spelt flour. 3 quarter cup of desiccated coconut. 2 teaspoon of baking powder. Half teaspoon of salt. Pineapple and coconut is a great combo and that's the unique thing about this recipe super delicious you just have to try it on to our wet ingredients this is half cup of butter and to that i'm gonna add three quarter cup of erythritol do check out my written post on how to substitute erythritol and what other sweeteners you can use so after a few minutes of mixing we'll get this pale mixture which is what we want i'm gonna use two eggs and i'm adding them one by one Now I'm going to add half of my dry ingredients at a time so that it's easier to mix. Once you're mixing your dry and wet ingredients, always make sure not to overmix the batter. This will prevent gluten forming so that your cake doesn't get dense and hard. Quarter cup of plain yogurt, one teaspoon of vanilla extract. That's it. Let's pour the batter into the pan. Bake this cake at 350 Fahrenheit or 175 Celsius conventional mode for 40 to 45 minutes or until you insert a skewer in the center and it comes out clean. Leave for 15 minutes before flipping the cake. I like to then cool it completely before slicing. Enjoy and thanks for watching guys.